Hello everyone, once again it's me, Croc199, and today we are going to talk about one of the largest snakes in Africa, and which is the African Rock Python. Now, African Rock Pythons, I do say despite their name, are found throughout Sub-Saharan Africa in grasslands. Adults do get quite large. They are known to grow up to about 20 to 30 feet long. They do have a tannish brown color with speckling on the side of their stomachs to the very bottom of their bellies. Now these snakes do, despite their size, they do tend to have large meals. They are able to consume lizards, birds, and also large mammals, which include antelope, probably also they'll feed on around rodents. Now, the egg, now the amount of eggs they lay is pretty well, I would say, pretty overwhelming because a, a female African rock python is able to lay up around 100 eggs. That's a lot of eggs. That's really a lot of eggs. People have, I've seen that people, some people are known to keep African rock pythons as captive pets. They are for experienced keepers, all into, which I mean experienced, I mean advanced keepers. Sadly, down in South Florida, they are known to be an invasive species because people didn't have the proper care for them and they just decided to let them loose in the wilds of the Everglades swamp. So, they have become a huge issue down there and have become a truly a um, problem species. When keeping a large animal like an African rock python, if you are experienced with reptiles and you're able to move the bigger snakes, then that is okay. But if you don't know the care or how to take care of a large snake, it's best like to just stick with something smaller and leave the big stuff to the egg, to the um, experienced handlers, keepers. So don't keep a big snake if you don't have the experience for them. If you have one, if you're not sure how to take care of one, please at least donate it to like a local zoo or um, maybe a local breeder who might take them in. I don't know, but don't just go on and release a, a cat animal that's not native to an area out in the wild because that will become a huge risk and will actually change the ecosystem and they'll actually start competing for with native animals over territory and food all right that's all for today if you like the video drop a like on it if you have any questions post them in the comments don't forget to subscribe i'm crack 199 this is reptile planet and i'll see you next time later